Hey, hello friends. How are you doing? So this is your buddy's table and uh, today we are here in with another wonderful video where we are going to discuss about how to install vMic Windows Management Instrumentation Command Line Utility on your uh, laptop or PC. So uh, the reason why I'm, uh, uh, we, I'm uploading this video is because uh, in recent versions of uh, Windows 10 and also on Windows 11, uh, Microsoft has announced that they have uh, deprecated this uh, vMic command line utility, which was uh, used by uh, many uh, system administrators and even by uh, normal users to get their uh, uh, RAM details or, or to get it as like few basic information. So without further ado, let's get started. So before that, I just want to show you what exactly is vMic. And before discussing about vMic, I would like to discuss about what is WMIS. So WMIS stands for Windows Management Instrumentation. So as Microsoft says, this is an infra infrastructure for management data and operations on Windows based operating systems. So this basically helps you uh, uh, get more information about your uh, um, uh, like laptop uh, or uh, PC hardware systems and uh, uh, run some scripts or jobs. Um, and uh, this WMI, uh, you can call it as a software. This can be accessed using command line ut utility and uh, that interface is called vMic, W-M-I-C in short. So this is what is deprecated uh, as of Windows 10 version 2 and H1 and also in uh, versions of Windows 11 as well. So uh, let's, let's see it is like how to install this. So first it gets if uh, uh, vmic was not installed on your machine uh, when you run the, when you go and run on your command prank your command prompt you will uh, get some error so let me show you that one so i'm just opening my command prompt so normally uh, if you directly go and run vmic so it will say uh, that vmic is not recognized as an internal or external command or sometimes some users may get vmic is deprecated or other related errors so that is what uh, that is an indication that vmic was not present on your system so uh, windows uh, 10 and windows 11 uh, they um, uh, they have it is like already provide an, an option to dislike add this feature if you guys if you really want so that is what we are going to see now so for that what we have to do is first we have to dislike go to windows and uh, click system So after clicking system, you can see over here that I'm using a Windows 11 OS and uh, in this vMic was not uh, available. So here in uh, what we have to do is we have to click the app section to get the vMic installed. Okay, so now we are inside the app section so inside the app section, you have to click optional features. And uh, here in it is like under installed features, if in case vMic is installed, it sh if you type in vMic, it should display the result. Currently, we don't see anything as such. So then what we have to do is we have to go to this top one, add an optional feature and click view features. So I'll type in vMic. So you can see here one future phone, vMic. So it says Windows Management Instrumentation Command Line Utility. So uh, this means it is like it is not installed or added on my machine. So I am going to uh, select it and click next to add it. So I am going to click install. So right now it is getting installed. It will take some time. Okay, guys, now that we can see it is successfully installed. So let's now open the command prompt and uh, run the command vmic to confirm so i'm opening the command prompt in administrator mode so previously it was throwing us uh vmic was not recognized as an internal or external command so now if i run uh, let's see what happens so i'm just typing vmic see uh as soon as i type vmic and press enter it was get me into it is getting me into the vmic cl it is not throwing an error so now you can add uh, like uh, uh, run uh, other commands uh, like get your uh, system information or uh, get your uh, RAM status and uh, whatnot it is like all, all sorts of things which you can do with vMic. Uh, 
from now on yeah so that's it guys hope you guys uh enjoyed this video and if you have any doubts or queries feel free to drop in the comment section and uh, if you like this video please feel free to give a thumbs up always your buddy stable there to help you out thanks guys see you in another useful video